Hello and welcome everyone. While Daredevil is a fan favorite character, the events of the Netflix series never left a major impact on the MCU. Because it's more of a street level series, the events surrounding it are far more self contained. That being said, the events occurring outside of the bubble of Hell's Kitchen do play a role in Daredevil and even impact the narrative in significant ways. These events also help place where the show takes place in the timeline of the MCU. And point to be noted, X-Men writer David Hayter recently appeared to confirm that a Daredevil reboot is in the works for the Marvel Cinematic Universe. So who is Daredevil in the comics, and what is he capable of let's find out. But before we get started, don't forget to like and subscribe, and with that out of the way, let's get started with the video. The character debuted in Marvel Comics way back in 1964, created by Stan Lee and artist Bill Everett. Let's kick things off with the origin. Matt Murdock was the son of battling Jack Murdock, a boxer who made his living in New York's Hell's Kitchen. Raising Matt alone, due to the death of Matt's mother, the elder Murdock took it upon himself to provide a better life for his son. He began to work as an enforcer for the Fixer, a local mobster, to give Matt more than his boxing winnings. However, Jack Murdock taught his son not to fight and tried to guide him into his studies. Matt became a bookworm and repeatedly was mocked by students. They teased him by calling him Daredevil. Matt didn't want to get his father mad at him, so he secretly trained himself so he could stand up to the bullies at school. While walking down a street one day, Matt noticed a blind man was about to get hit by a truck. He ran in front of the truck and pushed the blind man out of the way. However, the truck was carrying radioactive waste and some spilled out directly onto Matt's eyes. Matt couldn't see anymore. Matt's remaining senses became hind, and he was able to see using a radar sense that showed outlines and shapes. His hearing became so acute that he could hear heartbeats. He could smell the faintest odor in a room. He could touch a newspaper to read it. After the accident, a mysterious blind man named Stick offered to help him develop his newfound powers and train him in martial arts. During this time, his father was enjoying some success in the boxing ring. However, he soon found out that all his matches were fixed, and he was to throw his next fight. Jack didn't want to lose his match in front of his son in the audience, so he went against his orders and won the match. He was murdered by the Fixer's men that night. After a few years, Matt went to Columbia University and studied law. It was here that he started up his law firm in New York City. Matt adopted the identity of Daredevil to begin his crusade against all the injustices he saw in the courtroom. The major villains he has had to contend with are the Kingpin, Bullseye, The Hand, Mr. Fear, Cobra, Mr. Hyde, and many others. Now let's briefly discuss his powers and abilities. Well, although the character is blind, his remaining four senses function with superhuman accuracy and sensitivity, giving him abilities far beyond the limits of a sighted person. Few characters know that the hero cannot see. Daredevil developed a radar sense, which is similar to echolocation. Writer and co-creator Stan Lee said that he was worried that blind people would be offended at how far he exaggerated the way a blind person's remaining senses are enhanced, but that his fears were assuaged by letters from organizations such as the Lighthouse for the Blind, which said that blind people greatly enjoyed having Daredevil comics read to them. Marvel's most powerful villain, the Bayonder once restored Daredevil's eyesight, but Suspecting a trick on Bayonder's part, Daredevil immediately insisted that his blindness be restored. When Frank Miller expanded most of Daredevil's abilities, he attempted to make them extraordinary enough to be exciting, but not on par with Superman, noting Superman's distinctly unbelievable powers. When Miller joined the title in 1979, the first thing he did to the character was revamp his radar sense and made it less distinct and more believable. He wanted Daredevil to have the proximity sense that some martial artists claim to have. Due to the character's sensitive sense of touch, Daredevil can read by passing his fingers over the letters on a page. The laminated pages prevent him from reading the ink. Daredevil has commonly used his superhuman hearing to serve as a polygraph for interrogation by listening for changes in a person's heartbeat. This ability can be fooled if the other person's heart is not beating at a natural rate, such as if they have an artificial pacemaker. Just as Daredevil's other senses are stronger, they are also sensitive. His main weakness is his vulnerability to powerful sounds or odors that can temporarily weaken his radar sense. This weakness is often used to immobilize him. While his radar sense mostly compensates for his blindness, it has certain limitations. He cannot perceive color without touch, and he can only read printed matter if the ink is raised enough for his sense of touch. However, 
The radar sense has shown on numerous occasions the ability to see through walls and fabrics. The radar sense also grants him an omnidirectional field of vision. These two latter abilities are the most notable advantages the radar has over normal vision. Though he has no superhuman physical attributes beyond an enhanced sense of balance, Daredevil is a master of martial arts. Daredevil's signature weapon is a specially designed baton. Disguised as a blind man's cane in civilian garb, it is a multi-purpose weapon and tool that contains 30 feet of aircraft control cable connected to case hardened steel grappling hook. Internal mechanisms allow the cable to be neatly wound and unwound, while a powerful spring launches the grapnel. The handle can be straightened for use when throwing. The club can be split into two parts, one of which is a fighting baton, the other of which ends in a curved hook. And with that, we will bring this video to an end. Let me know your thoughts in the comments. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.